Hey, Pepperheads and Chili Freaks. It's Slade again. We're going to do another pepper review. Uh, and today I'm going to be redoing, be reviewing this monster right here, which is a Butch T. Mississippi strain. Now, from what I'm being told from others that have tried it, it's very hot pot hotter than a normal butch tea. I'm just going to cut into this thing. It smells a little like, uh, has a green peppery type of smell. There's the inside of it. And I'm not going to take any seeds out of it. I got a couple of more that I can get the seeds out of, so something hanging off over there. Cheers. A lot of seeds. A lot of seeds. Heat building. Had kind of that green pepperish flavor. Heat still building. <coughs> Heat's building on the back of the mouth, on the top of the back of the tongue, and right there in the top of the throat. Heat's all over the mouth now. <clears throat> all over the tongue. A little bit right here in the throat. And the eyes worn. A lot different taste than the regular butch tea.
different kind of heat and burn pattern. This has a slower build of a burn to me. It's not really getting any hotter, it's just kind of hanging in there just at that one level. It's got the inside of the mouth all tingly. Throat burns right there at the Adam's apple. It's peaked, coming down. Still got the little stingly, tingly, stinging feeling there in the mouth. Still got seeds in my mouth. But yeah, the heat's gone down quite a bit. Still nice warmth all over the mouth. Not so much there in the throat anymore. I said it had a nice green earthy kind of flavor to it. A slow build in the heat. When it reached its peak, it just kind of leveled out and hung there for a little while. Then it starts coming down. So a slow build to a slow descent of heat. Very good pepper. Very good pepper. So, yeah, catch you guys later. Peace.